Welcome back, everyone. Ray Ferraro down at ice level. My name is James Sabalski. The EA Sports broadcast team is fired up to bring you this one here tonight. He's the man between the two benches, Ray Ferraro. Any sort of thoughts before we drop the puck on this? Well, talking to both coaches, they both kind of oddly stressed that they wanted to be really aggressive in the game. The problem with being aggressive is you can pull yourself out of position or you take penalties and really hurt yourself. Well, we've been waiting for this one all day long, and here we go. Let's do this. The puck is dropped. We're underway. With possession along the wall. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Carolina's moving it into the offensive end. He almost lost it for a second there. A quick one here, and look at this. The first goal of the game. Anyone's really settled into the game yet. And already we have the game's first goal. Shooter's able to corral that saucer pass, and then he beats the goaltender. has got the game's opening goal. Ray, you were preaching quick start here before this one. Well, everybody wants to do it, but the way you do it is by getting shift after shift. Everybody at the highest rate possible. This early goal will help. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Through center along the wing. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Here's a short pass to Reynolds. Carolina's got the puck along the wall. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. And he handles a cross-ice pass. Here's a shot. Comes up with the stop. Denies him again. You don't want to give up too many of these during the course of the game. The odd man rush puts the goalie on alert, but he makes a good stop. Carolina's had the shot advantages, and they also have the lead. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. From the right side, they gain the zone. And he's ridden off the puck. Off the one-timer, just wide. Not really close with that. He got lots on it, but nowhere near the net. Puts it to the front of the net, and he gets a paddle on that one. This is a quality chance if the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. Still lots of time left in the period. The Cougars lead it 1-0. The Rockies take possession off the faceoff. Oh, and he completely blew it on that miss. Yeah, you got to get it on the net, James. You've got an opportunity to score, and you don't even test the goalie. Colorado's moving it up the ice. the puck away. The Cougars have it against the wall. Puck knocked loose in neutral zone. Colorado's got possession at center. Shot in front. Turns it away. Oh, you're not going to get a better chance than that, but the goalkeeper does a great job. The setters will glide into the dot. Marcillo's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Right in the slot, and they come up empty-handed. Smith's got it across the line. Strong defensive effort. From the slot, and that's stopped by the goaltender using his head this time. Oh, he gave his head a quick little shake after he made this save. That puck hits him in the mask, and his ears are likely ringing. The Rockies win the draw. Simpson's lugging the puck. Across the line from center. Simpson's got it against the boards. He scores! What an effort to get this game back to level. You've got to continue to work even when you trail in the game. They did that, and now they have a brand new game to play. Man, it looks like a bus depot. 
in front of the net. You know it's a tough one when you can't see the goalie. That means he can't see the puck. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. We are all tied up in this one. Colorado's got a hold of the puck off the draw. By number 91. The Rockies take it along the wall. Carolina's got the puck. The Cougars are in transition. To the low slot. And now it's grabbed by Domi. Gains control of the puck here on the blue line. Loses his balance on the play. Colorado's on the attack. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Good job tangling up his opponent here. No one home on that play. The Cougars play it along the boards. Sends it in on the attack. Colorado's got the puck along the boards. Looking for space inside the D zone. Coughs up the puck after that hit. Puts it in deep. Carolina's gained possession along the boards. That pass goes a little sideways. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Moves it quickly over to Morton. Throws it in. Colorado's got a hold of it along the wall. Moves it to Conway. And now it's to Ennis. Takes the pass from the left wing. Good defensive effort to poke it away. The Rockies played along the wing. Takes a wrist shot. Puts it high. Yeah, it sounds great. Hit the net, though. You got a better chance to score. Loose puck battle along the boards. First period nearly in the books here. Quick shot, and that's blocked. Taken along the wall by Mahomes. 23 seconds now. 11 seconds to go. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. Both teams strike offensively as period number one comes to an end. Fans, tonight our world famous Glenn Feast dropping $50 gift certificates. Keep your eyes to the sky for tonight's big prize. Still lots of hockey still to come, so get ready here on EA Sports. Ray Ferraro bringing you all the action. Period number two is about to go. Period number two now underway. Let's see what this one has in store for us. Ray, we've already got 20 minutes under our belt here. What are your thoughts of this one so far? Colorado's got to get on their horse a little bit here, James. They really haven't generated much in the way of shots on goal yet. Quick pass to Gaias, and that pass goes awry. Colorado's looking to break out. Takes the feed. Colorado's got the puck against the boards. Carolina's got a hold of it against the wall. Quick feed to Gaias. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Works it across to Reynolds. Solid check to slow him down. Carolina's looking to break out of their own end. Here they come up along the wing. 
Jostling for the puck, and he loses control. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Big play inside the defensive zone. Into the attacking area from the left side. Munoz will move the puck behind the net. Effective use of the paddle on that one. Moves it to Washington. Up along the wing. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. From center, they get into the attacking area. Puck picked up. Scores! That lock's broken. That's a big goal, and they put him into the lead. seconds from the time that puck's delivered to find it. He can't see it, so he drops into the butterfly and hopes it hits him. The Rockies take a one-goal lead here in the second. This game doesn't look like it's going to stretch out at all now, James. Even though there is a lead, it seems like it'll stay close. Carolina's won it. Puck picked up in the open ice. Colorado's got it in the neutral zone. Carolina's got the puck in their own end. And now he tries to get it across to Domi. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Excellent stick work on the play. Hunt's gaining momentum. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. And he denied that opportunity. One of the things he was working on is trying to control where the puck goes after he stops it. The corner is a pretty safe place. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Here they are on the attack. Sean gets a piece of it with the trapper. Moves right to the middle. Here's a chance in front. And another stop. No time to take a breath. He made that first stop, and then the puck turns around on him again. the midway mark of the frame. Colorado's got the momentum with a one-goal lead. They'd love to add to that. And a solid job tying up his opponent. And that's broken up. Sets up from Gretzky's office. And the puck's booted away. The Rockies scoop it up along the boards. Sends it in deep. The Cougars have a hold of it in the defensive zone. And they'll dump it in. The Rockies gain possession along the wall. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Takes the feed. And it's a quick pass to Black. Feeds the puck to Morton. Sends a pass over. Streaking into the attacking zone for the right. Straight up the middle, here they come. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Rogers. Smart heads up, play to neutralize the threat. Carolina's had outstanding stick positioning. Coaches will love to show this in the video tomorrow. Gaias moves the puck. The Rockies have it against the wall. Makes the save. Getting into the later stages of this period, it's 2-1. The Rockies will go to work here in the offensive zone. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Washington's dangerous in the offensive zone. He's got it now, and he's already got the go-ahead goal. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Great poke check on the reach. Maintains possession. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. The centermen glide into position. Off the draw and a nice job locking up his opponent. And makes the save. Big save by the goaltender once again. Baldwin's able to get out and make the save on that great A chance. The Cougars move to the offensive zone. 
Slides it back to the blue line. Oh, target! Still too close to call in this one as the second period comes to an end. If you want to show us your accuracy, register now for our Shoot to Win contest where one lucky fan will shoot a puck from center ice to try and win an exciting prize. And we'll be right back for what should be a very intriguing third. chasing the puck much of the first two periods. If they're going to get back in it, they've got to possess the puck a lot more. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. Colorado's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. Backus has won the faceoff. Can't catch up to the pass. Here's a short pass to Backus. Takes the feet at the back end. And that takes guts to get in front of that one. Moves it quickly over to Albert. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. The Rockies have it from their own end. Reynolds gains the zone. Colorado's gonna play the puck from behind the cage. Taken by Backus. Whoa! Scores! That's three unanswered now. Well, there seems to be no way to stop them. They got one, and it seemed like the momentum just changed so far in one team's favor. It's a snowball effect now. The coaches talk about getting to the front of the net, make it difficult on the goalie, take his eyes away. Man, he only could see the player's butts in front of him. He can't even see the puck. Colorado's now widened the lead to two in this third period. What was pretty interesting was one of the guys told me as they came out for the start of the third period, the coaches didn't come in. They left it to the players, wanted them to run that intermission by themselves. And that's picked off in front. Baldness plays it along the wall. Handles the puck. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Carolina's won the face-off. Wrist shot from the slot. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Along the half wall with the puck. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Can't finish. Oh, Ray, and blown opportunity. It really is. I mean, the play is sitting right there. There's a scoring chance to be had. They just don't execute it. Puck scooped up by Munoz. And that's blocked away. Scooped up along the wall by Brown. Carolina's got the puck along the wall. Colorado's gained possession. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Grabbed along the boards by Washington. Backtracks with the puck, but maintains possession. Steps inside the line. And he regains control of the puck. Here's a chance, fires the wrist shot. He was left in there. And sends it off course. The Cougars gain control of the puck against the wall. Receives the pass. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Colorado's got it along the wall. Nice poke check. Moves it to Rogers. Chase right in front. Stops him with the glove. Yeah, it's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. The Rockies have looked good tonight, especially offensively here in this third period. 
Colorado's got it in the offensive zone. Skates to the crease. Long jam in front, that's broken up. Good use of the body on the play. Nothing doing on that. Tries to get the puck over to Domi. Takes the pass. Oh, smart heads up play to put that one away. Colorado's got control of it now from their own end. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. And sends it just out of reach. Colorado's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Quick pass to Reynolds. All alone! Slides the puck over. And that falls apart. Oh, that's disappointing. Nothing out of something that looked dangerous. He grabs the puck here at the point. Morton's going to play it against the half wall. Couldn't connect on that pass. Scrum ensues along the boards. Colorado's got a hold of it along the wall. And he slides it quickly to Bacchus. Colorado's got it in their own zone. Pumps the puck away. Carolina's got possession at center. Sent into the offensive zone. The Rockies get a hold of the puck along the boards. Pumps it away in his own end. Quick feed to Ennis. Grabs control of it at the point. Colorado's got the puck against the wall. Backhander in front. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go one for the puck. Left in the third Under period. a minute to go here in regulation time. Thorne's got it in the defensive end. And now it's over to Gaias. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Carolina's goalie is on the bench. The extra attacker has jumped into the play. Colorado's in now. Fires it down the ice and comes up empty. Angles it over to Gaias. Along the right side into the offensive zone. With the steal. Wide open net. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Nice pass. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Off the left wing and into center. Towards the gaping net. Misses the net. Carolina's got the puck along the boards. Stopped by the goaltender. There's the final horn sounding, putting this baby to rest. Colorado's puck possession, really the difference tonight near my ring? I would say so because the game was close and really never spread out. They had the puck more, so they were more dangerous than their opponents. And there's a salute to the fans after another victory here in the house. Yeah, look at the way the energy percolates through the building. You got the music going, the fans are saluting the players, and vice versa. It's a cool vibe. On behalf of Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us. Good night.